Happy freezing Tuesday night. That's right, we're in for a freeze warning tonight into early tomorrow morning. Temperatures at the airport should get down to around 30 degrees. I think we'll hit 31 or 32 in town. And even a lot of our coastal areas could see freezing temperatures tonight, right at 32 degrees at the beaches. Here's a look at overnight temperatures. Inland areas, especially in southeastern Georgia and to the north of I-10 in northeastern Florida, we'll see temperatures between 28 and 30 degrees. Along to the south of I-10, all the way down into Putnam County, and then out across Clay County and most of Duval and Western St. Johns County seeing temperatures between 30 and 32. Eastern St. Johns and some of Flagler counties do escape freezing with 33 to 35 degree overnight temperatures. After a freezing start, you also have to worry about wind chill. Your winds that will exist early tomorrow morning around sunrise will make it feel more like the mid to upper 20s, so dress appropriately. Under sunny skies with winds around 10 miles per hour, our temperatures will make it into the mid to upper 50s for an afternoon high, spending most of the day in those chilly 50s. We're in for another light freeze on on Wednesday night moving into Thursday morning, but not quite as chilly as what we're expecting tonight. But then we finally get out of the 50s for the first time in several days on Thursday afternoon, making it into the mid 60s under partly cloudy skies. Our favorite temperatures are back on Friday. We're back in those low 70s after waking up in the mid 40s. It does come with partly cloudy skies and a chance for some evening to overnight showers. And it's our only day this week that we do make it into the low 70s. I'm a little disappointed in the weekend forecast. It could be quite messy at times with decent chances for rain Friday night, Saturday night, and Sunday morning. And so it's not everyone will get the wet weather every time, but we'll do have decent chances for showers throughout the weekend. That's all ahead of a cold front that pushes through on Monday and turns us chilly and sunny again, not getting out of the 50s Sunday afternoon despite, excuse me, Monday afternoon despite the sunshine. For more information, you can read our detailed analysis on newsforjax.com. Have a great night.